Do you think trauma boosts creativity? I fuck with trauma, bro. Yeah. I'm pro-trauma. I'm, I'm honestly pro-trauma, bro. Yeah. It's the spice of life. Welcome. Welcome to the show. Me. Thank you for being here. Yo, I'm gonna just ask you a bunch of just stupid ass questions. That's cool? You feel Sounds good about good. that? Yeah. Do you think humans are good or evil? Do you think there's <clears> like <throat> a, a human nature? I think humans are pathetic, bro. No, like we just we just scum in earth. Like we're disgusting. Yeah. Like Yeah? You really yeah. feel that way? I really do. I think we're the lowest life form. What would you say is the highest life form, what you think? A fiddly fig. Fiddly fig? I love a fiddle leaf fig, bro. I'm not even gonna lie. No, I'm gonna be I got I got passionate about it real quick. I really like a fiddle leaf fig. Okay. Bald eagle, uh -huh. bobcat. Shit, man. Polar bear. Okay. Um, the polar bear. bear is isolated. Yeah. Based on its dominance. Right. Like only isolated animals really are like the polar bear and like the kangaroo. Everybody else has a comparable opponent, but except for them. Polar bears, they got like scientists and shit over there. And they eating them. That's just food. That's just food. Right. I don't know why my phone is ringing. They trying to silence you. Let's You're put my mom this. on the show. Yeah, get your mom on the show. Hey, mom. Hey, hey I'm, 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 you want, I'm in the interview. Say something to the mic. You on speakerphone. Say whatever you want to say to the people. Oh, I just want to say hello. And, uh, Hold on. Don't, why you, why you, use your real voice. <laughs> I just want to check on you, see how you're doing. But I wanted to support your show. I'll talk to you later, son. All right, mom, I love you. You really my nigga, mom. I love you to death. I love you. Bye-bye. I love her. That's my dog. She sounds like a great person. Yeah, man. She yeah. getting old, bro. Like, I like my mom in her old age. That's good to hear, man. Yeah. I like my mom, too. Yeah. And I call my mom. She's in Nigeria right now. I can't. Oh. Like, not metaphorically, like physically. No, I know. Okay. I'm just making sure yeah. you seem worried. I mean, because it's really only two things to do in Nigeria. It's what? like get money or like take money. So yeah. I don't really know where she falls on the spectrum. But it's not for them to know. You know what I'm saying? We know right, we talk course. about that later, but of course. You money. never you don't know till you get kidnapped. You that get happens. what I'm saying? What and it depends on who you get in money with or mm -hmm. taking money from. Yeah. You think the music industry is gonna last much longer? As as far as what? As a concept. Oh, nah, it's over with. Yeah. Yeah, it was over when Mike turned white. That was the sign. It was that over that long ago? Mm hmm White Mike was the start. It's like global warming, like it's gonna be sprinkled throughout. Mm -hmm. But then White Mike died. And then it's like, that's the first sale, sporing. Well, you don't think White Mike dying was like a rebirth? Could have been? Symbolic? When did Spotify happen? 2009. And when did Mike die? Oh, shit. Hmm. We should cut that. Yeah, people are gonna have a problem with that. No, 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 they're gonna kill us. Do you think we're in a simulation? What do you think people mean when they say that? That they don't like their life. They're not gonna go rob the bank. So like, I don't care. I'm from the era where like one day you all hanging out on the block and it's like, damn bro, that's what's up. Like you learn how to tray flip. You can tray flip? Hey, where Donovan at? Oh shit, man, he went down. What'd he do? He robbed the bank. What? Mm -hmm. Damn, man. And then that's how the day goes about. But somebody made an effort to break out the simulation. Yeah. But what's the fucking simulator like, bro? We're dumb. We get dumber as the day goes by. I We're in a simulation. It's not real. I'm Shut up, bitch. I think this is the dumbest society that humans have ever been. I don't know about that now. No? There was a point in time where we lacked toothpaste. We just hadn't thought of it. But you know what we also lacked? We also lacked sugary treats. You know what I mean? No, we didn't. Hella starch. Hella wine. There was a time without wine. When? The past, I don't know. Exactly. Hella wine. It's been years, as far as we can recollect. Jesus had wine. Freaky ass nigga. There was a whole era before Christ. It's called before Christ. Yeah. Still had wine. That was before wine. Then why is it called before Christ? And not before wine. Because one thing's more for. one thing's more important than the other, man. Is it? You think wine more important than Jesus? Go find me, Jesus. Nah, I'll find you some wine. Poor Blanc. All right. Point Vince. I'm gonna open this globe real quick for no particular reason. Think about that. Is that a goatee? Mm -hmm. Is that it's Dwayne the Rock Johnson? That is Dwayne the Rock Johnson. As a Mardi Gras figure? It's the Rock We were given this. By who? 
I don't know. Look at this and tell me if they were black. See how they treat us? See that? You got a nice they setup. They want us to look silly. It's a nice setup. I like that Jay-Z is over Rick Rubin and John Lennon. Put him over these white people. They shot 50 Cent nine times. He's still here. They shot John Lennon once. And look at that. Look at that. I'm not saying it's significant, but you know. I'm <laughs> just saying, man, sometimes it gets down to the genetics. That's all I'm saying. That's eugenics for you. That is eugenics. Nine is greater than one. You know what's crazy? Let's say this. That's 50 Cent. That's John Lennon. The math makes sense. Math checks out. That's JFK. I get you. He tried to change the world, but the window was rolled down. Ragtop. You think black people should time travel? Yeah, why not? What if Harriet Tubman was just a time traveling alien disguised as a slave? What if Harriet Tubman is just like a more advanced version of, of Lupita in costume to save and free blacks so she could become Lupita? So you're saying Harriet Tubman came back from the future to slavery times and then she just lived till now to be Lupita? She came back. She traveled back to the slavery times and then in order to reverse engineer fair wages. You know what I'm saying? And then she was in... Yeah, 12 years of slave. So she's just now just like, that's a victory lap, basically. You're not seeing it. I think I'm seeing what you're, you're seeing. You're seeing it? I think I'm seeing what you're seeing. I'm just saying, you got to think about what performance it had to take to go up to the white man and say, help us be free. That's Juilliard shit. That's not just like, you don't learn it at Massa House. The one little problem in this theory is how did she get cute? You died mm -hmm. and you went to hell. Is there somebody that you would fight first? I want to dance off with Michael Jackson. <laughs> like we talking pure fisticuffs? Yeah. Just like oh, a yeah. fair one? Oh yeah. Frankie Lyman. Why? I really don't have a reason, but it's like, it's honestly speaking to me. Would you want it to be a fair fight or you just sneak up on him? I want to fail. I just want to see where his hands are. Like, we can shake hands and stuff. I'd be like, what's up, Frankie? Like, I need that, bro. Okay. Like, I out of love. That. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, if it's just like a friendly fade, like, Frankie Lyman got to get down. Michael Jackson, you got to dance. Um, I mean, I bet I want to ask Osama about soccer yeah. and karate. Because it's like, at what point was you just like, fuck the sports? Right. At like 6'6". Six, six. Like, at what point did you not try to go G League or something? Right. Like, he was hooping. Yeah. He had to be. I just feel like that's weird. Like, he was weird for that. Yeah. Niggas just want to block their blessings and not live up to their potential. Like, right. like grow up. It's really up. Grow up. Yeah. Like, don't be terrorists. Like, yeah. Like, okay. man. Oh. You gonna do a couple would you rather questions real quick? I'm focused. Would you rather get abducted or you gotta abduct people, but it's like a nine to five? Got I'll it. abduct. Yeah? Yeah, I'll abduct. How do I have to treat them? You just gotta abduct them. You just gotta get them. It's a lot of people on their phones. I can probably get 10 a day, keep it real. Yeah, just hit that quota. <clears throat> yeah, I can hit my quota and I'll go enjoy my life. Yeah, yeah. but then it's, it's like Amazon delivery, you know? They got one day shipping. Mm, Amazon truck right. abducting yeah. people. Somebody go, is that my package? And just grab them, throw them in the truck. You ain't even gotta work hard. Okay, I respect that. Yeah. Would you rather attain enlightenment, break the cycle of reincarnation, rid yourself of suffering and desire, or have dinner with Jay-Z? I like what you did there. Cause it's the same thing, really. We gonna reach Nirvana, baby. Me and y'all say, we going to Samsara. That was amazing. Would you rather build, build a new society on Mars or fix shit on Earth? Fix shit on Earth. Like, we just got so much Papa Do's, Mardi Gras, mm -hmm. the Foot Locker. Like, as a society, we had a lot of great things, so. I would fix it. Like, fuck Mars. I think they only say the Mars shit so atheists can have a heaven. You ain't gotta believe in God, but they still gets, got this afterlife shit, you know? Yeah. The afterlife really just your Instagram page. You die and then you get to live the life you told people you were living. Mm -hmm. It's like, oh man, he, I, I miss him going to Bora Bora. And then you die and it's like, this is the first time I've been. Yeah. It's my first time in Bora Bora. Then they just scrolling, watching you live. Yeah. 
should have deleted that shit with that spaghetti. Cause now, now that's you, you spaghetti man. Damn. Yeah. You believe in God? Oh, fuck no. I believe in the idea of God, but I think it's like a nigga sitting crisscross applesauce in the sky. Uh huh. Like creating birds from scratch and shit. That just sounds silly. If God was real, what do you think it would be? You think it would be like a, like an animal? Well, like I don't. Well, there is a book that says the early development of the human brain has kind of created what we perceive as consciousness, conscience, and also God. So, you know, maybe God is our conscience. Maybe God is consciousness. Okay. Maybe we're Just God. The ability to perceive. Yeah, you know what I mean? That right. voice in the back of your head. Imagine being a caveman and that voice is like, yeah, man, don't do that. Like, imagine the first time that happened for a nigga. It's like, we just been trying shit up until this point. Yeah. You telling me I'm not supposed to do something now? And it's in his head though. Yeah. Then it's like, oh man, we don't need to do this. Like, who's we, nigga? You think Moses said it was a burning bush because he was scared of his own thoughts? Like I that? think Moses suffered from alcoholism and neglect of like his circumstances as a human being. And then he had a, a short psychotic break, which kind of reached his schizophrenia. Um, but you know, that was kind of created by the pharmaceutical companies, angry black man disease, the yellow man disease, like just no inherent American racism. So I feel like he was probably dealing with a little bit of that. And the nigga was just like lame. Like, Moses was lame. Who did he know? Who did he kick it with? In the Bible, everybody got their batch of homies. Like who was who was with Moses? Yeah, I went to the Bible, nobody knew you. Yeah, like, <laughs> lame ass nigga, man. And people naming their kids after that lame. Right. Like, Imagine being Moses now. Yeah. What's your name, bro? Shit, man. Nice to meet you, bro. Moses. Like, I want to take that handshake back. Man. Yeah. Yeah. It's wanna, disgusting. It didn't feel good. Lame ass nigga. Yeah, man. You think rap music would be different if Ronald Reagan never existed? I kind of fuck with Ronald Reagan. Like I don't from a, know. from a perception know. of like being like a white man. Uh huh. Like what what else to do? But be a white man. And he like, kept it true. He kept it true to that. Like he reached his full potential. He said, "Look, you're if you're a fucking uh huh, and it's okay that you're a -er, but you're still a -er. I'm like, but I'm your natural predator. It's not like he didn't lull you to sleep. He said, "Get those ears a crack rock, shut them up." Yeah. You know what I mean? So it's like, let me know how you coming, bro. Right. Like and Ronald Reagan, he let us know from the jump. He was a country western um, mm -hmm. actor. Right. Movies wasn't that good. He couldn't fuck with Clint Eastwood. So no. he said, I'm going to take these ears out. Yeah. And as thus said, I know how you coming. So now if right. I see your great grandchild on a field trip at the, you know, like the science museum or something, I'm, I'm going to grab it by his ponytail. I'm going to slap the fuck out of it. Like repeatedly because right. it's a Reagan. Right. And gotta, I like to know where my enemies lie. You got to let them know how the world's going to treat you. You got to yeah. let them know where you stand. Yeah. And Ronald nice. Reagan let me know. Like Ronald Reagan said, hey, bro, it's beef. Yeah. So now it's like, all right, man, I thank you, Ronald. Like, don't be outside after seven. Right. Now, on that note, this is a personal dilemma I have. Mm. I know it's Black History Month. I feel like black people should get credit for building America, but do you think we should accept that credit? Uh, I honestly don't want credit for building America. This shit is janky, bro. That's how I feel. I'm going to be real. Like, we ain't really do the best job because we ain't had the best tools. Like, niggas ain't give us not, not one screwdriver. Right. You feel me? Right. Not one circular saw. Not a single screw was driven. So if we had the ability to, to drive the screw, then maybe it would be better. I don't want this shit. This shit janky. Yeah. Why are we trying to put our names on a failed project? Yeah, this shit's trash, bro. Yeah. We got some shit over there on the motherland. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we yeah. got some shit. We don't need this bullshit, man. Who want raising canes? Like, yeah, right. Do you think trauma boosts creativity? I know you talk about that a lot. And I fuck like, with trauma, bro. Yeah. I'm pro trauma. trauma. I'm I'm honestly pro trauma, bro. Yeah. It's the spice of life. Yeah. Now do you think we should like fabricate some trauma for some people or you think we need to like just let it happen naturally? We definitely need to fabricate some trauma. Yeah. I mean, just life is all about flavors, bro. Yeah. You think we all need a we all need a Reagan slapping the shit out of us? No, we slap the Reagan. We slap the Reagan. We slap the Reagan. Oh yeah. But since okay. we know, since you know the apex predator. You go get the cub. Right. You got to let him know who's boss. Yeah, yeah. Right, 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 right. Shout out Ronald, man. Shout out Nancy. Shout out all the Reagans. Like, mm -hmm. it's, shout up, out. it's up for your, it's up for your seeds. Shout out all the, all the white girls named Reagan as a first name. Mm -hmm. I don't know who told you that was cool. Mm -hmm. Like, I hate him hard for all of y'all. I think you should put that out into the world. We'll but put him, let him know I got hate in my heart? Yeah. Oh, it's very understated, so I agree with you. Yeah. 
I feel like a lot of people interpret that as like you putting negativity out. And it's like, you already got the negativity. Negativity is not that bad, man. If Especially you, not in math. If we accept it in math, why not everywhere else? Yeah, because they're trying to say niggas can't count. Little do they know. Did we invent math? Let's say that yeah, for the rest of us. Just put that on the record. Put that on the record. Yeah. I think we should hate more. What do you think about it? I feel like, you know, the word hater, I feel like it's had a resurgence in society recently. I personally feel like there should be more haters. It did disappear for a minute now that I think about it. You yeah. Got, you got hateration, holleration, hate mm -hmm. it or love it. Uh huh. And then after that, it kind of got quiet. High hater. It felt like white people tried to take it for a second. That was the term. They tried to take it, and now we're trying to take it back. I think it's been used as a as a as a pejorative term, as a negative thing mm -hmm. now. But I think I think maybe we need more of that in our society, you know? Because how do you fix shit if you don't hate on it first? If you ain't gonna hate, you gotta tell the truth. Right. But the hate, and you got the fake love. We either need real love and real hate, or we just need like to fight to the death. Right. Like on some Mortal Kombat shit, like, yeah. like mandatory, like weight classes, like gladiator, really get back to the essence of like human brute force. Right. I think keeping it real is the way to go. But you know, really real. Yeah. I'ma preface this by saying I agree with you, but why do you prefer dubs over subs in anime? I'm really not that well versed in the anime community. With that being said, I've been to Japan. Yeah. I got money over there. Yeah. I can sub if I want. Like these niggas and these niggas sitting in rural Kentucky, never seen shit. Want to talk to me about how I watch my manga movie? Let me manga movie how I manga movie or you get a passport, bitch. L loser ass nigga. That poverty not going to help you. But these subs is going to help me. So who the, who really, really wins in Japan? Who really wins when your prime minister gets assassinated, assa assassinated. At the, with, the, with the 3D printing gun? With a, yeah. with a fuzzy lumpkins boomstick. That was a boomstick. It was, it was a boomstick. <laughs> But that's just government. That's real government. Like, yeah. what's government without assassination? Right. Like, and I don't want to be this guy and be negative, but like, like, like we're due. We're due. We're due. We're due. Yeah. Mm hmm Why do you think people stop doing that? Social media. You do like other kinds of art, or you think it's important to do that outside of like rap, hip hop? No, you gotta get in where you fit in. Yeah. We have one life to live. We have a lot of experiences to kind of explore. And, you know, you might get paid more money. That's true. It's also win-win. So, like, I always wonder, like, rappers always like to say, like, I'm not a rapper. Or I'm more than a rapper. That's because they they they're, they're, they hate themselves. They hate themselves. I'm not a rapper. I'm not a dude. Like, what's the, what's the difference? You know what? I felt the same way, and then I thought about it for a second. I was like... You think it's them just trying to actualize their full humanity outside of their profession? Mm -hmm. I don't think Baby Gunfight is thinking that. Fair enough. Mm -hmm. All right, we're going to do a lightning round. All right, cool. You think humans have free will, yes or no? No. You think American democracy is real or fake? No, fake. You think wage labor is slavery or no? No. Slavery comes with a whip. Mm. That's it. There's only three of those. It's mm. a really fast lightning round. That's a fast lightning round? Yeah. They said the lightning rounds weren't fast enough, so I made them too fast. But lightning doesn't really strike black people. Melanin. Right. Yeah. It's Protects like a repellent. Because we are the cloud over the white man's sky. I like that. That made me want to just go ruin a white man's day. It's easier yeah, than you think. Just smile at him. Sir? You know what I love doing? When they smile at you on the sidewalk because they think that's anti-racist just, just get on the phone and talk about nobody the violence yo this white man just looked at me just say it real loud hands or feet nigga pick what size shoe you got on weirdo what's your fico score you bitch ass nigga hey what's your social security number you ain't even in jack and jill you bum what's your mom's maiden name bitch ass nigga no one language lame ass nigga <laughs> trying to fuck my shorty get on duolingo bitch ass nigga you not even nigerian you regular black. You got one passport. You vacation where it's nice at. You lame ass nigga. You bum. You ain't even been back to the village. You don't even know your roots. You've seen roots. And you thought it was okay. Get off my phone. 
Good talk. Yeah, man. I got one final question for you. Mm -hmm. We already kind of touched on this, but do you think it's possible to build a better world or are we stuck in what we made? I think we should just let it fall to shit. See what happens. Just let it go. The dinosaurs did it. And look where they are now. Museums. Exactly. <laughs>